Hello and welcome to Iceman channel. Today we're going to look into something that one of you users asked me today, or previously. And it was, how does the Chameleon Ultra use to recover keys from a MyFair Classic card that it supports? So I thought that would be a great topic for a video to show you and my findings with it, which is not kind of that obvious that you think it is. So let's tag it on and I will show you what I found out. If we start like this, I have my Proxmog VSL client here and then I have the Chameleon Ultra from here. So what I found out is first I let you know this is when I run this command and run the client there on the UI for Chameleon Ultra, you see that it's found and detected on COM port 7. If I go over here, because you see I have both the Chameleon Ultra connected and the Proxmoc. The Proxmoc is identified on, correctly on COM port 9. However, when I try to run it, it will fail. And that is because the UI seems to hog up the serial port communications. So you have to turn it off. I think you have the same problem as I've been having, and now you can connect to a Proxmoc normal. Kind of annoying. If you start the Chameleon Ultra UI, your Proxmoc will fail, or the Proxmoc client will fail to work. So I have three cards. I have a, let's start with this one. Uh, whoop, go over there and go over there. And we do this. I have three cards. Let's look at the first one. Info, thank you. What's all my for classic? This is a my for classic week, so it's a dark side attack and nested. The next one is a Yen 1A, a Chinese clone. And then the third one is a classic EV1 with hardened. So we're going to try all of these three on uh, Chameleon Ultra. And if I do the HFMF uh, F check, on the first card, a normal one, and the F-check needs to, well, it, it misses out one key because it's in the dictionary and not in the default one, so that's in the client. If you try the same thing for the other one, it finds all the keys, and the third card, it finds, not all cards, not all keys, should find at least. I just want to show you what it's found out. So it doesn't find these keys, right? So all of this is what's expected to find for Chameleon as well. And beside this, uh, there's a special case here where we read out the key, which is not shown here, but it's not in the default keys. So it's another thing of proximal client. Now I need to exit this one. And then I'm gonna go over to the UI. And now we try the same thing, but with Chameleon Ultra. So, click on this one, and we head over to read card. Uh, actually, no, because I need to do something first here. You need to go into save cards, and you see it says dictionaries. I need to add this dictionary, because you can see that I have to do this over here. I, oops, I'll do this again. I click on plus sign. I select the MyFair Classic default keys that I have in the Proxmark repo. Just open it like that, and it's all loaded up. All right, that's how you do it. Made sense. I'm gonna go back to this one again. Thank you. We're gonna go over to read card, and we start with the first card. Let's me do this. All right, and we press read. Now get the choice, check keys from dictionary. Remember this was the one where the first one failed or wasn't in the dictionary. And when we can try, you know, now we can try the recover keys button. And it finds it. And now I can dump it. And now I can save it as just one. And you will see that it's in here. Okay. So that works. That's how you do use a dictionary. Again, key recovery on a, on a weak uh, nouns card. Now this next card here is the generation 1A, Chinese. 
go for read. You see it's a magic card because of the UID up there. 11, 22, 33, 44 is not a normal UID. Check keys. It doesn't find that key that the Proxmark finds because it doesn't read. Let's see if we can do uh, recover keys. It doesn't do that. It doesn't know anything about Chinese cards and how to read it out from them. Let's try the last one there. My Fair Classic either one with a hardened one. I have that underneath. We go for read. And go for check keys. And you see it goes slowly through and test all the keys for the different sectors. It's pretty decent speed if you want to think about it when you compare it with Proxmark. We let this one run. There we go. So a lot of keys didn't find. Let's try to recover keys. And it can't do that either, but it's correctly identified as my fair classic EV1. And there we have it. The current support for uh, my fair classic cards on uh, my fair or the Chameleon Ultra UI. Uh, maybe it's better in the CLI. The command line interface I don't think so but uh, it's pretty good so far and I hope it just improves with that said I hope you enjoyed this video it's a short one and uh, please like subscribe and share this video or whatever you want to do have a great one